Cena. Oh. AA attitude adjustment from out of nowhere. So here we are gonna discuss and I'll provide with all the full length matches of Fast Lane 2023. If you wanna watch, all you have to do is just let me know in the comments. Let's start with the results of this pay per view. The show kicked off with the match for the tag team championships Cody Rhodes and Jey Uso vs The Judgment Day. The match was longer than expected, some great spots were involved with the delayed vertical suplex, a crossroads on the announce table, Dominic Mysterio tied to interfere, Ripley hit Jey Uso with the briefcase. Yet after all of this, Cody Rhodes delivered a Cody Cutter followed by the Splash to win the Tag Team Championships in a long decent match. Next match was the Street Profits and Bobby Lashley vs the LWO. The main highlight from this match was who is gonna be the third member of the LWO and it was Carlito who made his return and at the end after delivering the backstabber helped his team pick up the victory. Next we saw the triple threat match between Io Sky, Asuka and Charlotte Flair for the women's championship. The match had some good high flying action. Sky asked Bailey to not intervene in her match, which nonetheless Bailey does, causing a moonsault from the top rope and helping Sky to retain her championship and continue her reign. Next was the highlight match of the night. We saw the GOAT John Cena team up with Ellen Knight against the Bloodline. The first 13 to 15 minutes was all Cena against Jimmy Uso and Solo Sikoa. They were keeping Cena away from his corner and John was taking some serious punishment until he tagged in LA Knight which caused a big reaction among the vocal crowd. At one point of the match all four of them were down and the crowd was chanting this is awesome. In the ending we saw Cena hit a 5 knuckle shuffle on Uso followed by the BFT by LA Knight to pick up the victory. After the match, it was LA Knight who raised the Cena's hand in victory to close out this night for the greatest of all time. Last match of the night was the main event for the World Heavyweight Championship Seth Rollins vs Shinsuke Nakamura in a last man standing match. Rollins was not 100% after sustaining a big attack on recent Monday Night Raw. During the match, a lot of materials like the kendo sticks, chairs, tables and even nunchucks were exposed early. Shinsuke was beating Rollins for a large portion of this match, Rollins came back with some offense of his own. The fight was spread outside of the ring in the crowds, the concrete outside was exposed and Nakamura delivered a backdrop on Seth right on the concrete. A large spot occurred when Nakamura drove Rollins with the double knees through a table. A big moment of the match came when the ladder was set up beside the announce table and Rollins fell badly on it. which I thought was the end but Seth beat the count but was immediately followed with a keen Sasha through another damn table and miraculously he stood once again. The end came when Rollins hit a falcon arrow in the crowd through two tables and Shinsuke could not beat the count and Seth Rollins retained his title. The match was the best of the evening and could easily be the match of this year. So again these were the results of Fastlane. Comment your thoughts on this pay per view. Another awesome video is likely to come in the coming days so stay with the channel, like the video and see you all until next time.